socialist Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez needs to either study or stop doing interviews. Sadly, she already has her New York election for Congress wrapped up, yet every time she opens her mouth, she exposes herself as an ignorant neophyte unprepared to hold a congressional seat. Her last flub was calling Israel occupiers of Palestine. She clearly only read one of the Democratic talking points on this subject, be anti-Israel. Though she clearly knows nothing about Israeli-Palestinian relations, she does know that as a Democrat, she is supposed to hate Israel. They all do, which still leaves me bewildered why so many Jews support the Democratic Party. Not surprisingly, Cortez actually has a history of supporting terrorists over Israel. Look at this tweet in May after Israeli forces were forced to kill rioters storming the borders of Israel, complete with Molotov cocktails, helium balloons carrying explosives designed to drop on the people of Israel. She called Israel defending itself a massacre. Here's the tweet. This is a massacre. I hope my peers have the moral courage to call it such. No state or entity is absolved of mass shootings of protesters. There is no justification. Palestinian people deserve basic human dignity as anyone else. Democrats can't be silent about this anymore. She called these people protesters. Protesters. They are rioters at best, terrorists at worst, and violent haters of Israel and the West, to say the least. Yet Ocasio-Cortez is cheered on by her left-wing Democratic colleagues, nearly all of them now proud to call themselves socialists. Yes, a 20-something uninformed Bernie Sanders robot is now calling the shots and even dictating policy for the Democratic Party as she has become the hero of the left. But she has a history of getting caught pushing this pro-extremist propaganda. Here she is with left-winger Jeff Greenwald of The Intercept, who asked her about the tweet that I just quoted. The idea that we are not supposed to talk about um, people dying when they are, you know, engaging in political expression um, just really uh, moved me. Political expression? They're throwing fireballs into Israel. Political expression. If she really believes these people are protesters, she just proved how naive and uninformed she really is. One look at the video will tell you these are not peaceful marchers. These are terrorists hell-bent on breaking into Israel. And many of them are hell-bent on killing Israelis. What she fails to mention is that the Israeli army gave numerous warnings before protecting its soldiers, its people, and its borders. The restraint showed by Israel is amazing. And socialist ding-dongs like Ocasio-Cortez never give Israel any credit. Because the only group they hate more than the people of Israel are the people who support Donald Trump.